da da a mini kettle. <laughs> Go back here. Da 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 a mini kettle. <laughs> I'm a girl. You don't know what I'm saying. If I was saying, I'm a girl. That's a me because I'm a, I'm a girl. I can say what I want to say. So I'm a girl. Leave me alone. Don't be me. I don't know your name, so you don't know my name. So don't talk ever, ever, nah, in my face. No, 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 <laughs> you ain't gonna give me no Kool-Aid or nothing like this, y'all. Oh, so, I mean, I thought you was gonna try to, like, treat me or something. <laughs> you need them cases? <laughs> Can you eat a potato that you said you gonna eat them? You've been saying that before we even started recording. Have you uh, lost your vehicle like yet? Or? Okay. Mm. So... You have a lot of gay people on your social media. Um, well, first of all, this is the biggest question on my social media. Everybody want to know, is he gay? Is he straight? Is he bi? Whatever the case yeah. may be. Have you sworn than a lady one? Like, what is that just like? How you feel? Just like, how you feel? See, I hate to make them cousins. See, I make them come and do it. See, I make them come and do it. Boom, boom, boom. I tell all my niggas, be a boss. Secure the bag. Ooh, that sauce is so good. So, Zill, what's the status of you and your boyfriend? But I, I heard the little Lolo on the Lolo sense, and they told me, like, you messing with the jail, bro. All right, Zill, hurry up with the Kool Aid, bro. Zill, yeah, putting that stuff in there make it taste really good. That make it taste really good. Thank you. Toast to Abbott's. You don't know? Wait, no, I don't want it. Let's talk about this jail girl first. My ex. Do your ex? Yeah. How long have you been talking? I didn't know you had a boyfriend. You don't tell me now. He's not what I am. Yeah, I'm not going to. You talking? Oh, that's how you talk to me on the radio. <laughs> I'm just saying. Um, oh, I've been going since Thursday. So y'all don't got to do it In my face. No, 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 Y'all say y'all did it? That's yes or no. You beat them cases? No. So what y'all did? Y'all just play foot scissors? I know. I've been known since three times. So y'all kissed at least before? No, because he wanted, I ain't making him until my boy went to like, like three times. Oh, so y'all kissed before? Yeah, I was like, I'm not going to kiss you again. 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 Like, I'm not going
to like my boyfriends and like I told them. He was a and what is the goals and qualifications to be your boyfriend? Um, <laughs> okay, so. Can you either pertain to the decision from eating? <laughs> You've been saying that before we even started recording, but now you want to act booty on this damn camera. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, okay. Um, so, what's the qualifications to be your, your boyfriend? Yeah, I have a good personality. Good personality. Um, I like your vibe. Mm -hmm. Um, what else? You gotta have some bum for yourself. Oh, okay, See, like, so you don't have... want no bum or no dusty feet. Mm -hmm. What about their feet? Like, is it, do it matter if it look cheap? Dirty feet? No. Crusty toes? No, you gotta Black toes? Feet. You gotta keep your feet to help So would you say my feet look cheap? Mm, yeah. Okay. Scale one to ten, what you get them, them toes? Your toes? Yeah, them cute, pretty toes. <laughs> I don't know why I give you a seven. Okay, so if you have to pick, Zia, like, who you, who is your best brother and your least best brother, and why? Mm. Okay, so. And be honest. Okay. Okay. Me and you got a bond, but then, but me, me and Dre got a bond too. What? <laughs> Bro, what are you talking about, man? Bro, I'm out, man. That nigga's tripping. Why though? Wait, why? Because we got a, we got a closer bond than. We got closer bond than my than my Okay, so tell me why me and your bond and you and Dre bond is like closer. Why? I guess I feel like I don't know. I think you relate more on stuff. And you look low. Like people still gotta get. I'm gonna edit that part out. You gotta talk louder, man. Okay. Oh, um, me and you got closer bond. Me and you and Dre got closer bond, I guess, because we just relate more. Dude, you must not be home. No, you act like the white people. No, I'm not real. Home. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. It's good, huh? And when you did that, put that little fake season in there, okay. and look no, it, it, good. it didn't taste good, but now it's good. It's good, man. So. What's what have you uh lost your veto out yet? Or no, you saying that because I'm right here and you scared? No, that you're gonna get beat I have up not you get, you been I ain't never done with nobody. So, are you scared that you're gonna get beat up by me? That's why you're saying that. Are you no, not, so you're not scared? No, so no, you don't I'm think saying. you can't get beat up? No, I'm saying that oh, okay. I'm saying that. I need my recall here. So, how you feel about protection when you start? All right. I heard that it's it feels better with out no coming up. Don't talk to me, all right? Knock it off! Uh, my opinion. Right. Um, oh, okay. So, you need chill. to put protection on. We're not going to do um, so do you think you're gonna wait till you get married or what? Wait until I get married to have sex? Yeah. <laughs> no. Damn. No. Brother, the dad, I'm in the ghetto. I can't wait till I get married. Look at that bad. Oh, okay. I'm waiting till I have a child. I mean, I'm waiting till I get married to have a child. No, I'm not waiting till I get married. That's too long. So. How does it feel being famous on social media? Like, yeah, like, um. and stuff, and like, bro. Well, people. that is pros and cons about it. I like social media. I like being big on the ball at the same time. I feel like everybody think I'm not human. I'm like, I don't have feelings. They always be talking and 
you know, talking cap, but you know, I don't give like, a damn about nobody, yeah. so I'm a boss. I don't care. But the funny thing is, it's like, people just be in your inbox, they say anything. Like, I be getting news, vagina, and weird stuff. I get butt holes, digglings, titties, cats, all kinds of stuff. And it just be, I, I be looking at, and a lot of people think I'm, I'm stuck up. That's not the truth. It's just that when I go in, you know, in the inbox to try to give people feedback and stuff and try to see positive things or people that are trying to promote businesses or something like that, they be nasty as hell in them inbox. So, I don't now, know. How do you know when somebody have respect for them? Respect for Damn, there we go. There we go. Um, um, that's how I feel about that. But like, you know, I just, I sit back and kind of take time or whatever it could be. Yeah. Um, you know. What's your 2020 goal? My 2020 goals is to just move, be like I can just do it. I feel like a lot of times people always want to talk about stuff, but they, right. they don't have no actions to go behind it. You talk about boss and being the boss, but then you have to show for it. Is bossly things, you know what I'm saying? So just be like Nike and just do it and move. Let your success be the spotlight on your haters. Shine, shine bright like a diamond. Shine. Um, and um, okay. Um, so. You have a lot of gay people on your social media. Yes, how, I do. How do you feel about those type of people? Um, well, first of all, this is the biggest question on my social media. Everybody want to know, is he gay? Is he straight? Is he bi? Whatever the case yeah. might be. The thing that he has for me is, you know, our uncle is gay. Right. So you understand, I love everybody. It doesn't matter. I don't discriminate how you look, what you wear. Who you are, what's your sexual orientation? That ain't got to do with me. I mean, I'm a boss. You understand? If you love me, I love you the same way. As long as you come at me respectfully and don't come at me the wrong way, I don't care what you do. You can get a hug from me just like any other individual. You feel what I'm saying? It don't matter what you do. It's just show love to me. I'm gonna show love back to you. You understand? It's not what you are, what you want to do. That's your life. Stop judging people. The Bible says judge not lest you be judged. So I have 50% straight people and 50% gay people on my, my social media. Anybody can show me love. Anybody can follow me. And I'm going to support everybody unless you give me a reason not to. It don't matter if you're black, blue, purple, or yellow. You know what I'm saying? So that's how I feel about that. I feel like stop. God is love. So it don't stop judging. Stop trying to deem somebody to be something just because they love everybody. You understand? That doesn't mean just because I hug the gay person and I respect and love a gay person just like a straight person. That doesn't mean that you are gay or you are bi or whatever the case may be. You understand? Y'all stop trying to be like the next person and just be yourself. I love everybody. Follow me. Boom. And that's just dead on that, you know? Alright. So uh, let's let's drop that one with you too. You know, son, son. Son, son. Son, son. Um, it's a lot of females that are, that's attracted to you. And I've been on your page and I've seen a lot of girls throw their stuff like, see, and some of them I'll be looking at them and you know, they're gay too and not. So I want to know like, have you sworn than a lady one or what is that just like, how you feel about that? Um, no, I ain't sworn no lady. Ha! <laughs> Got it! <laughs> Got it! So what's your view? Um, I mean, I like what I like, but... Boom, okay. Yeah, I like what I like, but don't mm -hmm. necessarily mean that I like uh, females. Okay, so how do you feel about people being gay, period? Oh, you don't judge no book about the cover. If, 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 you, if, that's how you, if that's what you want to be in life, then mean, so be it. You can be gay, you can be straight, you can be bad. Can't nobody judge you but yourself. Come on, Lily. I like that. You need to speak a little louder, but I like that. <laughs> Can't nobody judge you but yourself. All right. So, we're not going to be like them bougie people off of reality TV and reality show. And the reason why we low is because my mom and them are not asleep. But right. we ain't going to be bougie like that. I'm going to eat. She's going to sit there and look cute. 
But the way this is set up, I need to eat. So I'm trying to eat, but yeah, I mean, I was wondering why you never in a relationship. Okay. You know what type of brother you got. I feel like this, you understand? You either gonna be on my level or you gonna be above my level. Right. If you can't meet me halfway or help me get to where I need to be in life, you understand? And vice versa, you understand? Okay. Then why are you around me? Because we can't help each other to do nothing. Because you're not trying to go with what my goals and my aspirations and my accomplishments right. taking me, you understand? You're trying to suck all the energy and life out of me. So if you can't meet me halfway and go 50-50 split, then you can't sit next to me. Dun dun, boom boom. You understand? I have a zero tolerance. I'm very territorial, you know that. Um, um, uh, I don't play about my money, my time, and who I'm, who I'm, who I'm. Um, and lastly is that I'm very aggressive. So and clean, you know what I'm saying? So I feel like, yeah, I feel, I feel like. You have to have a level of intelligence to be around me. And I feel like a lot of people don't. They're intimidated by that. You feel what I'm saying? I secure the bag. I'm my own boss, you understand? I don't got right. one, not two, but three bank accounts. I got my own car, my own house, everything situated and take care of, you understand? So you can't come to me. You feel what I'm saying? I'm not a basic ass nigga. I'm real. So you got to come to me correct. You feel what I'm saying? And, but... To be real, like, it's somebody up in my periphery that, uh, you know, just stay tuned. That's all I'm going to say. I'm waiting. Mm -hmm. But, um, sis, last time, because we're going to wrap, okay. wrap this up, but, um, how for, like, everybody, like, because this is a hard thing to lock it down, clink, clink. Stop, stop. Like, how have you been celibate all this time? Like, I want to know, like, what's your secret in the pudding? Because that's hard. Most of these girls, 13 years old, they got babies. Really? Nothing. I mean, I can't, I have to trust you in order to. But you, like, yeah, never I thought know. just to, like. Oh, to have sex? Yeah. Oh, I did. <laughs> Trust me, I did. Trust me, I did. You thought about it, but what made you respect yourself enough not to do this? Because these dudes these days, they're like, okay, you give your virginity up to this dude, and then this thing, you know, he look back and maybe like test homeboys or go and, and how can I put it? <clears throat> They just run it off and yeah. they talk too much, you feel me? And I have to trust you. Talk about your D and saying, oh, I effed her, I smashed her, I smashed her. Right, like, it's kind of like a playful thing. I trust you that much to you. And you betrayed my trust. Right. And you see it happen so many times. So now to you, it's like, I'm not about to be one of those spectacles. I'm, I'm right. the boss chick, you feel what I'm saying? It's just going to be me. We're not about to sit and see and then go bust out. I feel, I feel exactly where you're coming from. But you know what? And I think that's why we're closer. You know, we, my mom got nine children and I feel like I'm more closer to you. You know what I'm saying? Right. Just because, you know, just the respect and the, you know, everything. I, I mean, all of my mom and children, like that mom saying, like, to see you love yourself so much and respect yourself enough to be like, I demand this. And if you don't give it to me, then You know what I'm saying? So. I just feel like I love it, you know what I'm saying? So I mess with that. But all at the same time, like if y'all like this video, make sure y'all like, comment, tell me what y'all and subscribe. You know, tell me what y'all wanna see me do next in the comments. Tell me what y'all wanna see Zia do in the comments, you know what I'm saying? Cause she gonna be rocking with me. Um that's my day one A1 plus. Every video you see posting on my page, Independent Survivor, Instagram, Facebook, Liz Lego Shape. Snapchat and these are she did it. Your girl Zia Badass. Okay, and you can follow her on what? Zia Badass. Come, come on, <laughs> oh, well, you could go ahead and say it because that's the name of the Instagram. That's just I'm not gonna do that. Okay, just spell it out for them. Something they need to know where to go to it. At. <laughs> okay, you can follow me on Instagram. 
Oh my god. Okay, y'all can follow me at Zia Z E A I mean yeah Z E A H B A D A S S S. Any yeah. other school and anything? No. Alright. Yeah. Well signing out. And this we it. Oh you can turk you can just turk in front of the food. No please. I'm not gonna turk in front of the food. Zia, what if and these are on the chain. I hate to make them do it. See, I hate to make them come and do it. See, I make them come and do it. Wham!